everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of our Pokemon Snakewood Nuzlocke here on the channel. Thank you guys so much for coming out and choosing to support the video. If you guys already know the drill, make sure to go ahead and leave a like as it's always appreciated. If you guys exceed 100 likes, I'll keep these episodes coming daily for you guys. So one thing before we jump into today's episode, I apologize about the lighting and stuff like that. Of course you can tell that behind me, the whole office has changed around. So I'm still moving things around trying to get the lighting right, but they're kind of just blurring on me right now and I'm trying to fix it. So hopefully we'll be fixed for next episode. But in the previous episode, we actually went ahead and we, 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 we did the whole Watson event where it turns out like Watson was the murderer. He's working um, with the bad guys. He's like working with the four horsemen people and stuff like that. A lot of crazy things are happening, but we're out here. We have to rescue uh, one of the guys, Galise. I think we have to rescue somebody like that uh, in today's episode. But of course the team all trained up, all ready to go. So I'm excited for today's episode. Let's go ahead and find out what we have to do because of course I actually don't know what to do. Um, last time around... Oh, oh, okay. I'm the daycare man. My Pokemon are protecting me, so I keep caring for them. If you'd like your Pokemon Breeze, have a word with my wife. Why do I feel like she'll be dead? No, you're not dead. Oh, okay, that's good. <laughs> I thought you were going to be dead, and I was absolutely terrified for him. Oh, this is all... Oh, this is a chef! <laughs> I absolutely love that when they do it. It's so funny. All right, Farmer Chef, he's got five po six Pokemon. Holy crap. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and start using Hoshikage, um, because of course, like, Hoshikage's had no, like, no screen time. I had no screen time. And I need to just keep wearing them down. I have to be careful because of the screeches. And I think I'm gonna swap out after this one, definitely. Alright, cool. Uh, spark on the curlier, because of course that thing will just get bodied. Easily done, the chef fled. Come back, chef! <sighs> Always makes me laugh, that guy. Always makes me laugh. We got a bunch of zombies to take on. And I think we're ahead. Oh my lord, look at the polyworm! Oh Jesus! God damn! I'm gonna go for the headbutt on you. I'm gonna go for the tackle. Oh wow. That focus punch surely did hit. There you go. <laughs> it's got a substitute. What? A protect substitute? That's insane. There you go. Oh, the zombies crumble to dust. You better. Cr oh. The chef roared out a challenge. <laughs> oh, wow. He's actually got a Snorlax. Oh, wow. Yeah, that hurt. There we go. Let's go into Z. Because Z won't take any hits. Oh. oh, my lord. What is he doing? Come on, Hoshikage. I need to stop falling asleep. Holy crap. He's just using rest constantly. Oh, this is not good. This ain't good. I'm gonna use um, an attack plus. And tackle. Stay asleep, Snorlax. Oh my boy, this ain't fun. Oh no, you are a 9 HP. Oh buddy, I really needed you to wake up then. There you go, Snorlax. Holy crap, buddy come through. Buddy's like the best line unit I've ever had in my whole entire life. The chef's hideous snarl returned to normal. The chef was cured of the formanus? <gasps> what? Whoa, whoa, what happened? <gasps> wow, you can actually cure them. That's crazy. I actually did not know that. That's pretty nice. I like that. I like that. So he returned back to his normal state. So I wonder if the chefs aren't... Are the chefs actually zombies then? Or are they just like possessed? I think they could just be possessed. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure, but I want to make my way back to... I, I want to say Veteran Turf. Oh, wow. It's actually all closed off. That's pretty great. That's pretty great. All right, cool. Anyways, we do get a new encounter on this route. Uh, let's go ahead and see what is uh, hanging around. It's a Roselia, which is not actually too bad. I'll take the Roselia. Um, a nice little grass... Uh, Orphorus ball. A rare ball made to commemorate a concert. Oh, wow. 
That's pretty neat. I like that idea behind it. Roselia, we're gonna call you... You're a man, and when you have... Oh, you're all more in this game. Um... I could prefer the female. I'm gonna call you Kaneki. Uh, it's got poison point, and it is a hardy nature, which kind of sucks. Um, absorb growth, poison sink, sunspot, just the usual stuff. Buddy has an item, though. And it's a plus band. I have no idea what the hell that is. <laughs> I love the head. Just the head is here. That is it. <laughs> just the head. Absolutely hilarious. So, the one thing that I've just kind of clicked back on that we need to do is, I'm pretty sure... We need to make our way. Oh, we get a bicycle as well. We need to make our way towards the sand sandstorm part. Can we steal a bike? Nope. You don't even get no bicycle in this game, bro. That sucks. That sucks so bad. Oh, what? You can just run over to it? Oh, wow. You can't. <laughs> I thought you could just run right over. That'd be great. That would be great. We get another encounter there, but of course it's all water types. Um, so I can't really necessarily catch anything. It's not randomized or all, so. Oh, wow. This is the desert. Straight up like that? Oh, wow. Okay, so I'm pleading and I'm praying. I'm praying. I'm praying. I'm praying. Please be a trap inch. Please be a trap inch. Please be a trap inch. Ugh. I challenged a troll to a battle, but he was way too powerful. His bag is huge and holds more than six Pokemon. What? That makes no sense. Oh, do we learn Rock Smash to anybody? Bro, we don't even have Rock Smash. How the hell do we... Oh, wait, I think we get it. Okay, I want to see if you can actually get an encounter in here. No, I don't think they put any mons in there. Bro, where do you even get Rock Smash from? Like, the guy... The guy who gave you Rock Smash basically lives there. Oh, are you here now? It's a corpse. His head has been completely reversed and filled with sand from the ears. Oh, wow. He doesn't even give you it. You can't even loot him. That makes me so sad. I wonder where the hell do you get Rock Smash from then? I know I got told I need to go save Gleese. Because I'm pretty sure Rock Smash is a TM in this game. I've been in the game corner, right? Yeah, I've, I've been in. Nothing is there. Hmm. That's actually quite interesting. What I, I I have no idea on where to actually get this thing. <laughs> you can't steal the bicycles either. Ah, oh, that hurts so much. I'm a daycare lady. No, I don't want you to raise any Pokemon. Uh, oh, wow, you have a God of War. That's terrifying. Stop using the Gatu. Ah, uh, so oh my lord. That hurt so much. Um. Oh, my lord. This ain't good. Z's gone. <gasps> we flinched it, buddy! <laughs> that could have been game over right there. Oh, wow. We flinched it. Oh, we lost... We, l we freaking lost thingy, though. Which sucks majorly. I lost my... Oh, revive. I lost my, um, my Magneton, though, so that does suck. Bro, where do you find Rock Smash? Like, I've got a feeling it's got to be around here somewhere, right? It has to be around somewhere, and I feel like it's going to be in, like, a corpse. Nope, okay. Do we have to go back? In here? Ah, you're the devilish strong trainer who defeated me in Marvel. Please don't hurt me. Oh, you can go in here. 
Islands of Calm. Oh, and we get an encounter here as well. No free way! Oh, yes, we get a God of War straight up. Yo, this is so good. Okay, we need to capture this thing. We got a Ralse as our first encounter. That is insane. That, oh my lord, no way. Oh my lord, that is absolutely incredible. I'm so happy. I am actually so, so happy. So, I want to call this Ralts. Um, what can we call you? Oh, I'm trying to think of the game. Um, trying to think of the name. The Gravity Girl in My Hero Academia. Um, Ochacho, is it? I think it's Ochacho. Ochacho. Is that how you spell it? I will find out. Oh, Chacho. My hero. Oh, there you go. So it's O C H A C O. O C O C H A C O. There you go. Chacho's on the team now. So let me get back up there. There we go. I love. How they've got like the Groudon and Kyogre music in here. <laughs> this is crazy. It's level 20. Press friggin' teleport for God's sake. Um, it's actually pretty great. It's level 21, so it's already to go into a Curlia. And then we just gotta get it up to level 30, which will be pretty neat as well. Uh, of course, we do have to train up Kaneki for the next episode. And I'll get, um, I will definitely get Ralts all trained up too. Oh, why did he stop pressing friggin' teleport? Uh, it's a calm nature as well. That's pretty great. Um, it's got confusion, double team, teleport, and calm mind. So its moves are already quite stacked as well, which are really nice. So my team's actually coming together quite nice here. I really just want the flag on. Like, I 100% want to capture a trap inch when we go into the desert. That's what I'm hoping. Anyways, we're on the island of calm. It could have been a shroomish or anything like that. I'm just so grateful it was a Ralts. This is pretty scary, though. Because I actually don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, there's a medikit there. What the hell? I actually don't know what's going to happen here. Oh, it's a dead end. What the hell? I feel like we got super lucky with the routes. Like, I 100% feel like we got super lucky. Yo, the music, though. It's so frigging creepy. There's a Weedle? What? Okay, so this is just leading me to nowhere. I, I genuinely don't know where to go. I have, I have no idea where to go. I think, okay, maybe I'm getting fit. I'm, I'm going somewhere? I, I hope so. Oh, what's this? Attention, do not steal berries from the boss's tree. <laughs> I will steal some berries from his tree, don't you worry about that. Oh, the friggin' Dickarina there. What? It doesn't want to fight. <laughs> I wanted it to fight, though. I wanted a Chikorita. That sucks. That sucks so bad. I wanted the friggin' Chikorita. Okay, I think we're actually making progress now, which is good. No need to go down there, right? Nope. Oh, okay. There's a... There's one of those guys to battle. It's you, the one I've been told to watch out for. Okay. Inquisition Footman. Oh, you have a hombone. One of the worst things ever to try and battle. There's a medikit there, which is quite decent. Um, I don't necessarily think we need it, though. Uh, let's make our way in towards the cave. Oh, is that Archie? Oh, stunt again. How to get in, are we? Well, if you defeat all of us in the Inquisition's Deadly Seven, then we might just tell you where the entrance is. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Bro, what even is this guy? You're a friggin' oddish, dude. Grr. You caught me by surprise, but you won't be the others. We Deadly Seven are tough. Like, is everybody supposed to be pirates? 
Like, bad pirates. Um... I'm gonna toss the speed plus, because I want to pick up the Max Alexa. What? Bro, why have you taken me here? I can't go up there. Oh, don't tell me we literally just have to keep running around. Oh. This is gonna be so depressing to do. Can you get in up here? Nope. Okay. Oh, that's great. Now, this game's freaking wild. We can't get it on there either. Okay, we, can we get up here? Yes, we can get up here. Thank God. I know where the entrance is. This is the entrance. I told you. I am the second of the Deadly Seven. You may, if so inclined, rever me. Bro, I don't want to do anything to you. <laughs> I don't want to do anything to you, my guy. It is I, the third of the Deadly Seven. Your winning streak ends here. Oh, what the hell is that? Kenshira. You know what it looks like? Have you seen the new Alien film? It looks exactly like that thing. You know, like the ones they made? It has gust. Oh my- Well, girl, you caught me by surprise. <laughs> Bro, that thing's hella ugly. Holy crap. That thing is ugly as hell. Oh, don't take me out. Oh, thank god. Please leave me. I am right in hype. Goddamn weeb. Oh, so I kind of got far that time around then. That's cool. So I've already defeated three of them. Only a few more remaining. Okay, let's go with my instincts on this one. So we go around here. The last time we literally just like ran to the top as far as like as high as we could. Unless I nugget. The fourth? You are the fourth? Be ready my wallet. <gasps> you have a trap in. That's so unfair. That is so unfair, dude. Yeah, every single time we battle, it's just gonna bring me out here, which is just so depressing. That's probably what we have to do, though. We just have to be all seven. Ah, there's another router. We have to be all seven in order to progress in the game. Um, it's just trying to figure out where the hell they are. I'm pretty sure it, it won't take too long. Like I said, we're already, we're already battling all through these guys. Dude, I just hate the fact that every time we battle, we have to come back here. That's just the worst thing about it. Okay, let me get back through here. I don't want to battle anybody. I just want to rescue Gleese. Here we go. This is better. The sixth member. There we go. We only have um, a few more. We literally have two more to take down, so that's fine. I'm buddies level 34. Holy crap. So, it's making me want to go there. But I feel like if I go back out here... Ah, uh, no! It was the wrong decision to do. It was the wrong thing to do. Okay, we're almost... We're almost done with all these guys, and then we should be good to end it off after that. Let me go down here again, and... Now, I feel like I should go back into that cave. Oh no, there's... Oh wow, there's more. You made it all the way to me, the seventh member of the Deadly Seven. Want to hear our secret? Then fight me. I guess. I'll kill you, Marit, first though. Here we go. Keep looking for other Inquisition workers. That's That will take you to the entrance of the base. Oh, okay. Oh well, thank you. That took me directly to the place I wanted to go! To a friggin' unknown place. Look, keep looking for the workers. Okay, I guess that's the plan. Is that just the plan to do that? No, I kind of feel like I want to go there. Nope, it's not around there. 
See, that looks very, very, like, it, it makes me want to go in there so much. But I feel like we have to get over there. What's over there? Ah, surprise, I'm the eighth member of the Deadly Seven. Now prepare to... No! What? No, you can't be. This is a new low for stupidity, even for this world. Still doesn't change the fact that I now am going to battle you. Uh, okay then, whatever. <laughs> Carfbit, what the hell? Oh, that looks so cute. Ah, you caught me by surprise, but you won't be the others. We Deadly Seven are tough. There's no friggin' Deadly Seven. There's no Deadly Seven! There's like 25 of you guys! How does that even make sense? There's like 25 of you people! That's annoying. That is annoying. Uh, but we are gonna go ahead and get up on out of today's episode. So a big thank you to everybody that has supported it. Next episode, we'll try and defeat how many godly other things there are. I need to train up the team a little bit as well, because we are going into unknown grounds, and I'm pretty sure... Um, it's gonna get a little bit tougher from here on out as well, so I'll do some off-screen grinding as well. But big thank you to everybody that are you are enjoying the Snake Wood. Of course, I absolutely love recording it. It's such a great game. If you guys haven't played it already, links are down below in the description as always. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new. And I will see you guys back tomorrow for a brand new episode. 